Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Domino Cygnus, and today I'm back with Pajama so Sam. Fast, you are doer. what you eat it's from your head to you, your feet. You tasty villain. God, the animation's not as good as you I was as in my opinion. Eh, <laughs> words. Anyway. How do I access my saves again? Clearly not escape. Okay, how do I do this? Ah, oh, there we go. Alright, so I actually haven't played this in a while. The time between the first episode and the sec this episode, um, quite a bit of difference, so I legitimately cannot remember a thing. Well. Hey, what kind of tree is that across the river? That's a condiment tree. A condiment tree? Condiments grow on it. I see. What's a condiment? It's a sauce to make foods taste better. You know, like ketchup. Oh yeah! Education! Alright, so I genuinely don't know what... Okay, so I've got to get him down. Wait a minute, go back, no, no, go back, ah, bloody hell. I just realized that horn would be useful. Can I use the horn? I have no idea. I'm already a little worried about this, this series going downhill, I mean, the game series. Because the first one I thought was pretty good for, for kids. Okay, here we go. Don't touch that. Okay. That is the fabled horn of celebration. It is blown only when I reach the answer to a question I have been pondering. I see. Um, second game. That horn looks pretty loud. Oh, it is. I like it a lot. Anyway. Syllabus, can you tell me the three parts of the great question of the nature of cheese again? Part one is which fork at the table is the cheese fork? Uh-huh. Part two is what type of cheese is the moon made of? Right. Part three is what sort of cheese is the best to put in a cheese sandwich? Hmm, I still don't know that one. I'll keep working on those. Okay, so anyway... But it was a bit flawed, and I'm a little worried that it's gonna get go further down. I have heard the fourth one is nowhere near as good as the others, so I guess that's part of my worry there. Oh boy, I'm gonna go skiing! It doesn't help that I haven't played this in a while, so I legitimately. I'm gonna have trouble remembering what I'm doing. Last one to the bottom is a rotten egg! You're literally the only one doing this, Sam. Alright. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> yeah, what? Wait, what? Oh, wait, am I supposed to pay attention to those signs? Okay. I'm gonna keep going for the square ones. Okay. Boy, that was fun. Does that have any impact on anything? Okay, I'm gonna. Ooh, that was not what I was thinking about uh, doing. Um, no, I'm gonna see if the tr if does the triangle thing have any impact. Normally, if I was, I will say, just a random thing, but when it comes to let's plays. I tend to just voice any thought that comes through my head. I'll need some skis before I go down there. I'll just grab them. Oh then. boy, I'm gonna go skiing! As I was saying, because if I was playing this by myself, I would really be talking very little. That's the thing with Here I go! Places. You genuinely just voice whatever thoughts go through your head. Okay, let's do the triangle ones. Oh, they're still so weird. 
I guess it's from back in the day, but still. It must be cold for Sam in that onesie. You know, in the bloody snow. What? Circle? What? Okay. Don't the, oh, what's with the shapes? I'm getting confused now. I don't even know. Boy, that was fun. I'm prob I bet you anything, I'm wasting my time, but the shapes, I refuse to believe that they don't have a- I refuse to believe that- that they don't have a purpose. They're either randomly generated so are just completely pointless, or they do have a purpose and I just need to figure it out. See, this is the thing with me, I'm probably way overthinking this. Oh boy, I'm gonna go skiing! And that's the problem with me whenever it comes to any game where it expects me to figure something out. I will generally massively overthink something. Here I go! I guess it comes from answering so many trick questions over the years. I just start to overthink things massively. Woo! So, triangle. Circle. And I'm gonna go circle again. Okay, it doesn't seem to be random, okay. There's got to be something behind this. Okay. That was great. There has to be something behind this. I Give me a second. I just want to know if this has a point, because I don't want to waste your time with this. Okay. I'm not seeing anything. Is it just pointless? Or is it just something that is only sometimes, you know, useful? It's just weird. Because apparently the first pajama Sam is also kind of random, but it did it in a way that it didn't feel random. Like there weren't disparate elements that made that, you know, I that looked weirdly out of place. Because, you know... That water looks kind of cold to go swimming. That wasn't what I meant to click. I meant to go this way. Yeah, you know, there weren't parts where I was looking and thinking, huh, that looks odd. Is that supposed to be useful or not? And it's only useful in certain playthroughs. In Pajama Slam, no need to hide when it's dark outside. It all felt... You know, nothing felt weird. And I'm sure there were parts that were weird. I mean... Oh. I guess the potions part was a little weird, but I don't think that was... But it did. But it felt like it was more just a thing to tinker around with than anything else. Oh, sorry, I apologize for that.
I'm trying to... I'm wandering around trying to figure out where I'm supposed to go exactly. Because admittedly, I don't think I've had a really real indicator of where I'm supposed to be going. Yeah. Sorry. Anyway. Hmm. Looks like I'd have to get all wet to go that way. Alright, alright. Be right back, sorry, I'm just noticing something. Okay, sorry, I just spent the time trying to get my like, bearings again because I'd literally forgotten how much progress I made. So once if I click her, just will she just remind me? Oh, it was really that easy. Whoop! Oh my! It's a good thing I can float. Say, the water is very nice today. Oh, that was a lot easier than I was given. I really got to stop overthinking this game. <laughs> it's for blooming children. What am I doing with my life? Why don't I'm you come in for a swim, like Dad? The water's lovely. I don't want to get too wet before dinner, but maybe you could give me a ride. Sure, hop on. Sam fell in then and then drowned. The end. Sure, let's go this way. Alright. Ooh, a box top. Another box top! Yay, I don't know how many of... Oh, eight. How many do I need again? What is it, like 20? I wonder if they'll say... If I can find 20 of them... There we go. Hello? Hello, French fry. I'm not a French fry. I'm Pajama Sam. Oh, so you are. Pity. Do you like French fries? I love French fries. Especially with mayonnaise. Mmm, mayonnaise. It's very European. That's the only way I'll eat them, actually, okay. is with mayo on them. Then there's no stopping me. I like mine with ketchup. Well, different strokes for different folks. That phrase, I've always pictured it in such a way that I didn't think you would ever be allowed in a kid's game. But alright. Wow, what a log jam! And it's all french fries! There's no items, so I can't really do anything. I was. What the hell? Okay. I don't know what that is, but it looks kind of gross. It's a heart. Hmm, I'm not sure. What a great day for floating! That's nice. Alright, so I need some mayonnaise, I guess? Eh. Okay... What should I do? Hmm... <gasps> Condiment tree! Boy, this is great! Look at all these different sauces! Yes, it's a condiment tree. Oh boy, ketchup. Ket Barbecue sauce. I put this on my peas. Mom thinks I'm nuts, but it's good. Uh, mm, mustard. I like mustard on my sandwiches. Same. This is Sometimes. teriyaki sauce. My mom likes to cook things with it. Ew, horseradish. Ugh. This stuff is too strong for me. But this is mean. Wait, what? Ew, horseradish! This stuff is too strong for me. But some people like... This is mayonnaise. Mom puts it in deviled eggs. Yum! Mmm, hot sauce! And it's the extra spicy kind. This one's vinegar. It tastes awful by itself. But it's good on salads and things. This is relish. The kind you make with pickles. Oh boy, ketchup! Ketchup is good on everything! Can't really this, argue, to be honest. This is me. I'll take this mayonnaise. It could come in handy. 
Alright, let's go and do the thing. I'm so glad I thought about to do that. Hooray! Let's... Look at that! Yeah! Mayonnaise! Hey! What is that? Is it mayo? Uh-huh. Oh boy! Oh god. Jesus, Pac-Man, calm down. Oh, he's drowning. Yep, he's dead. Well, so much for not getting wet. I thought that was fun. Let's go in. Ooh. Okay. Muscle Beach. Hey! Hi! I'm Pajama Sam! Are you one of the delegates for the peace conference? But yes, I am Pierre Lupin of the Breads and Grands group. Can you get out of there? Alas, no. I have tried. I believe that the only way for me to escape is for you to ring the bell at this game and win me. Hmm. Well, I'll see what I can do. Thank you. For the peace conference to be deprived of Pierre, this is not good. Okay. Here's another box top! Crap. I'm gonna just try this. Come on, Sam, you can this do it. This looks like fun. Come on, Sam. You can do it, shake that ass. Yep, oh. there we go. Wow, he's way better than me. I'm not sure I can do this. You're way better than me at this than, than me at that game, Sam. So, I mean, don't be too down on yourself. Ha <laughs> ha! But seriously, folks, let me ask you this: What goes ha 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 plop plop plop? I don't want to know. An orange holding its breath. What? That doesn't make sense. Hey! You ain't funny! Bring back the other guy! Don't you get it? Orange? Breath? Plop, plop, plop? Plop this, wise guy! Oh! It's true. He really isn't very funny. <laughs> but hey, tell me. What do you think of these shoes, eh? <laughs> thank you, thank you. All right. Next up is Tom Rutabaga, the Knock Knock King. He's gonna go kill himself now. How about a nice hand for Mickey Hollandaise, folks? <laughs> Jesus Christ. Mickey Hollandaise in his great big shoes! Wow, the floppy shoes. All right, folks, oh, check the bloody this out. Stuff. It'll knock you right out of your seat. Oh, knock, bloody knock. Stuff. Who's there? Omelette. Omelette who? I'm a lot funnier than Mickey Hollandaise is. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I got a knock knock. <laughs> Who's there? Say, is it all right if I take your pumpkin? Sure, kid. Knock yourself out. Thanks. Sam's awfully happy about all of this. Hi! I, um, I saw your act. <sighs> Tell me the truth. Did I stink? Well... I knew it. Oh, I am awful. No, I wouldn't say that. No. Oh. <laughs> A box stop! I'm finding a lot of these. I never find them all though, but still. I'm such a failure. 
Did I tell you once I bombed so badly that the audience followed me home and threw vegetables at my house? That is bad. Jesus Christ, that's... <laughs> yeah, I got a million of them! Knock, knock! Who's there? I... No. Hmm. Wow, what a great-looking Ferris wheel. I wonder why it's not moving. Uh, I don't know. Maybe because it's not on? Did you ever think about that, Sam? Did you? Did you ever think about that? Oh. Okay. So... Oh, there's a beach. I guess I drew... Oh, I have control, okay. This cauliflower is much bigger than the others. Mm-hmm. Can I talk to these Boy, guys? Boy, you guys look healthy! Yeah, we know! Mushrooms. Hi, what's up? Boy, you oh, girls you know, look unhealthy. We're just baking, you know? Yeah, just soaking up some rays. Let's see. This exercise machine is connected to the Ferris wheel. Yep, that's right, little dude. When we work out, it makes the wheel go around. All right. I'm not sure what else to do, so I guess I'll just get moving. I think I know what the pumpkin could be useful for, so let's go do that. Hey, Sprinkle, how about another ride? Sure, anytime. This, I hope this works right. Alright. Um, look, a sweet potato! Where is that? I don't see anybody. Okay. Oh, hello, sir. Welcome to the A complex, Mr. Uh, uh Gord. Sam Gord. Mr. Gord, very good. Oh yes, that's that's very good. All right, here we go. I think I'll just go on in here now. Hold it, that's the. Well, oh, wait a minute. It's Gord's only, right? Yes, and he's a Gord, so I guess that means um. That means we let him in. Ah. Crikey. And I always thought I was stupid. Well, I am, but this makes me feel better about myself. This is more cramped than the ho Here's another box top! There we go. Thank you, Fatty Bear, for keeping count. I bet I could see all the way around the world with this thing! Well, let's not do the entire world. Monterey Jack. The moon is made of Monterey Jack cheese. Oh, well that answers that question. Neat. All right. So we got one question answered. Let's save this. I'll get back to this uh, in the next episode. So anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Pajama Sam. You are what you eat from your head to your feet. Which, one thing I've just, which I thought about actually is, he actually didn't say the title. I was expecting him to say the title, and he didn't. He's not said the title once, and if I remember correctly, he hasn't said you are what you eat from your head to your feet, and I feel somewhat disappointed by that. Anyway. If you enjoyed this video, remember to like, fave, and subscribe for more. I'm the Dominus Ignis. Bye, guys.